every year women from all over the country come here to San Francisco to compete in the Miss Chinatown USA pageant. Yeah, that tradition started in 1958, and this weekend the winner and the contestants will take a ride down Market Street as part of the Chinese New Year Parade. Gianna Franco joins us with more. Gianna. Yeah, hi guys. And the competition is so much more than a beauty pageant. It's actually a chance to represent their heritage and their community. Miss Chinatown USA has been a San Francisco tradition for over 65 years. And for pageant co-chair Chelsea Hung and her family, they've been a part of the pageant for many of those years, starting with her mom. So she would used to uh, go to rehearsals with the ladies and um, take them out and um, kind of be like a mentor. So I was able to tag along sometimes. And Chelsea watching from a young age. Hoping one day when I grow up that, oh, maybe that won't, that could be me. She would go on to be crowned Miss Chinatown San Francisco in 2016. Now I'm giving back and want to uh, mentor these young ladies. Now she guides the next generation of queens. Miss Chinatown USA is an ambassador of goodwill. I also participate in other events such as going visiting schools to read to children, going to different festivals just to see the community members and everyone else. Contestants compete in various categories including talent, public speaking, poise and beauty. But they're also eager to support their community, one that has been the target of hate crimes in recent years. A report from Stop AAPI Hate says that from March of 2020 to December of 2021, close to 11,000 hate crimes towards the AAPI community were reported. And even though it's a competition, I think in preserving Chinatowns, we're preserving symbols of what we endured in the past and what sometimes we continue to endure today. So I think that in participating in this pageant and um, hopefully, you know, we can learning more about Chinatowns. I can spread awareness of our culture and to help people understand you know, what China is all about. These contestants are proud to represent their heritage. Well, the Miss Chinatown USA uh, pageant is actually happening tonight, and a winner will be crowned, and she'll also be awarded a scholarship of $10,000, which is incredible in itself. She'll then have the opportunity to compete in Miss Chinatown International. There are other titles that are up for grabs, so Miss Chinatown Chamber of Commerce, which is actually the first runner-up, and Miss San Francisco Chinatown is also mm. crowned tonight. So, and all the wow. contestants will see tomorrow in the Chinese New Year uh, Parade, the Lunar New Year Parade, so that should be pretty fun. And the winner as well. Yeah, That's and, it's, awesome. and it's more than just a pageant. This mm -hmm. is about representation. This is about representing the community and that neighborhood. So true. And you hear that from all of the contestants. The most important thing is that they have a chance to have a platform mm -hmm. where they get to share their own experiences as being part of the AAPI community, as well as the things that they've gone through and their heritage, which is yeah. so important to them. Yeah, their stories are so inspiring. Mm -hmm. It's neat to see them be recognized yeah. for that. Yeah. Very cool.